Hi Resisters, happy Wednesday to you. Hope that your week has been phenomenal and that you uh, have some great plans for this weekend. We're gonna do our um, rep challenge today. I guess we call it Gut Check 600 and we talked about how we're gonna step it up each week and actually add an extra 100 reps. So today will be Gut Check 700. I thought about just keeping the same exercises as last week and just adding a new one, but that was a real that was a real barn burner last week, that 600. So we're gonna come back, we're gonna do seven new exercises for this challenge. Not new that we haven't done before. You're gonna see a lot of these repeat over time, but uh, we're gonna do seven new ones today. You're gonna do the, just the same as last week. You'll do 10 reps of each exercise, and as you get through all seven, that'll be one set, and you'll do 10 of those, we'll get to 700. Then next week, for the last, the last uh, Wednesday of our challenge, we'll do 800. So I'm holding a basketball because we're going to utilize this today. If you don't have a basketball, get something that you're going to be able to put your body weight on and it will, it will hold you. The, well, I'll just say basketball is a good size. As you get to other sizes, it's not bad. You smaller balls on this one. No tennis balls, that's a little small, or golf ball, forget it. So it has to be something that is respectable in size. So with that, I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to introduce today's. I'm going to go through one set with you. Um, there are going to be two videos today. One will introduce the exercises, so you can go do that on your own if you want to. Just, just take the PDF, print it off, and go do it. Or you can go through, I'll do also do um, one set of the 700. So this will be the introduction of the, um, of the challenge, of the other exercises. So we're going to start off with flutter kicks. So most people probably know what these are. These are going to be three count flutter kicks. So just like this. You're gonna come back and keep those heels off the ground. And you're just gonna go back and forth. It's one, two, one, one, two, two, one, two, three, one, two, four. The head, it's up to you. If you wanna have it down, if you wanna have it up, whatever's easiest. And so those are flutter kicks. From there, our second one is gonna be the horizontal scissors. So we're gonna go from those straight into these. So nice out wide coming across. It's a two count. So it's there, one, two, Three. So those are horizontal scissors. The third one, we're gonna stay down here, we're gonna do rowboat. This takes a little bit of coordination, not too much because I'm able to do it. And so if I can do this, then it should be a piece of cake for everybody because I am not very coordinated. That's why I'm a distance runner because there's not much coordination regard to do uh, distance running. So here we go, so we're gonna come here, we're out, we're coming up. You wanna use those hands, so it kinda of looks like a rowboat. Each one is one, it's one, two, Three. So those are robots. Now we're going to grab our ball, do some push-ups. This one is a little more involved. It's a, there's, it's a two count as well, a right and a left. These are, um, you can do these on your knees if you need to. These get a little difficult because we're going to work out one peck at a time. And so we're going to start here with our ball. We're going to come down, up, and roll that over down, up, and that's one. So, roll it over, back, that's two. So, those are basketball push-ups, or whatever ball, volleyball, uh, whatever ball it is. So, we're gonna go back to hydrants. Last week we did a hydrant combination, we're gonna do a different fire hydrant combination to really work on that. But, and I'm gonna be mean, the last exercise today, you're gonna go right into it after your two sets of hydrants, uh, you're gonna go into one that's gonna work those even more. So it's kind of mean, but deal with it, it's, it's, it's good. So on a hydrant, remember we don't want to arch that back, we want to keep a strong back, and so come right on through. You can put a lot of pressure on the back if you, if you don't watch it, so, so pay attention to that. The other thing is, pay attention to making sure that you get up to 90 degrees, and so we're gonna do the outback. So the hydrant outback goes like this. We come out to the side, down, and back up. Both of them go into 90, and that's one. Boom, two, three. And then what we're gonna do is we're gonna go over to the left side. And so that is our fifth exercise. Our sixth exercise is over to the left. So out, back, one, out, back, two, out, back, three. And then our final exercise is we're gonna come into squat jumps. 
So especially as you get further into this, you're gonna find that your butt is gonna get on fire, and then you're gonna come into the last exercise of each set is gonna be squat jumps. So make sure on this, we have, we're dropping, as you come down, you're not coming here to touch. You're dropping those hips, coming down here, touching, and then shooting up. Here, shooting up. Here, shooting up. Each of those are worth one. And so, that will be one set when you get done. 10 reps of each exercise, and that will complete one set, and then you do 10 of those, we'll give you 700. So, good luck, have fun. The next video will be me doing one set, one complete set with 10 reps of each. Have fun, have a great day, y'all.